breaking news, Trinidad's justice minister says Jack Warner should stand trial. Now in the video, he speaks about what he should do. If you love Trinidad and Tobago, I ask you, go to your trial so that we will hear what the facts are and not what you say they are. And when you go, if you are to enter into any plea arrangements, then we hope that what you shall speak shall be the truth and not further fabrications, as we have had to endure this last several years. Let me just say that this is a problem for all of Trinidad and Tobago, and the solution rests in the heart and the conscience and in the hand of Mr. Warner to vindicate us by ab not absolving himself, by admitting to what he has done, if he has done, because he's entitled to the presumption of innocence like anybody else, but put himself to the trial and let the, let the chips fall where they will. If it is that Mr. Warner um, cares about Trinidad and Tobago, then he should go there and have his trial held. Because I'm a lawyer, and I will tell you, for many, many years, the innocent always rush to an early trial. And that if there, um, that is for a, upon which we will see what is true and what is not, by cross-examination or otherwise, then I think we all deserve that. So as a patriot, I am asking for him to do so. Well, it, it has been hurt, but how we conduct ourselves from now on will determine how we will be hurt in the long run. As I said, this is a battle for truth, and if Trinidad and Tobago is to have its image um, repolished, if I may put it like that, so that the true beauty of this nation will be seen and not be identified by the actions of Mr. Warner and those around him, then I think um, th that is why it is so important for us to speak to this day and to ask him to please save the reputation of Trinidad and Tobago. Now, according to BBC, Jack Warner, as I read, so solicited bribes worth 10 million from South Af African government to host the 2010 World Cup and deliver funds for personal use. Now, the, the BBC's report from Sunday said it had seen documents showing Warner has used the money for cash withdrawals, personal loans, and to launder, launder money. Now, this is all about the ongoing investigation of nine FIFA officials and bribery. Stay tuned for further updates.